Hello my friends and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, I don't again, I don't know how you found me, but welcome. Uh, you might just be interested in the topic and what we're talking about is the Pope and his comments on civil unions. And if you're looking for me coming after gay people, then you'd be sadly mistaken. We're gonna focus on the Pope because I think that's a more important issue than talking about gay people. Like, you just do you, homie. A couple of days ago, um, the Pope said homosexuals have a right to be a part of the family, they are children of God, and have a right to a family. So he was just coming out and saying, talking about same-sex unions. He did not say same-sex marriage, but you know, they're basically one and the same. And he said a right to a family. I don't think anyone has a right to a family. I think that's not true, you know. If <laughs> um, that's not something that's like God given, you know, he doesn't promise anyone that they find a wife, have kids. The only thing he promises is eternal salvation after death if you believe in him. So that right off the top should be, um, that was just a dumb comment. Um, and um, Raymond Burke, he is always criticizing the Pope, at least to a certain extent, more than most people. He said such, or rightly interpreted as a simple private opinions of the persons who made them. So he's just saying, well, that's the Pope's opinion. That's not any, that's not what the church stands for. And then he said, such declarations generate great bewilderment and cause confusion and error among Catholic faithfuls. Which he's correct. So it's not that there's necessarily anything wrong with his statement, except like there is. But if you are head of a church, right? Your church allegedly believes in that Bible right there, you know, um, then I feel like you have an obligation to be faithful to whatever the Bible says. And does the Bible condone gay marriage or civil unions? No, it does not. And therefore, your stance on it should be whatever the Bible says, despite whatever your personal opinions are. You know, like, do I personally care about gay people, like, if you're gay or not? No. But, the Bible says that, so, like, if you, if you claim to be a Christian and you're telling me you're gay, uh, you're a practicing homosexual, then well, there would be some problems there, right? Um, just the same way as, like, you said you're a Christian and you're like, oh, I'm a raging alcoholic, or... Maybe you're straight and you just have sex all the time outside of marriage, you know. The, both of those things, I'd be like, cut it out. Um, so yeah, that's all I had. Not a long video, but anyway, have a wonderful day. God bless you and goodbye.